big step is how you make sure that people understand what the laws are about, that they know what they're about, but also that they know where to access assistance to secure and pr protect and promote those rights. So that's the first leg. The second is while well, our clause in our constitution talks about participatory democracy, the question is whose voices are heard? It is always those of the privileged. And so we make huge efforts now to ensure through different modalities, new communication strategies, that women themselves, particularly in rural areas, are able to be heard directly by those who sit in parliament.